what's up y'all how y'all doing today it's your girl Shay, and i'm back with another freaking house tour y'all so my freaking kid he is sick i hear one of them right now they sick and um school has the nerve not school but child care child care has the nerve to tell me like oh it has to be 24 hours without a fever before he can come back and i'm like i want him here tomorrow because i can't take no days off work come on now come on now Let's just go ahead and start this video because I seen this house and I just instantly fell in love with it. Okay, I fell in love and I was just like, oh, I need money. I'm trying to be in broke. Like, I need money. Like, that three, five, three, well, I really could get approved. What I could get approved for is like four to five. Um, But baby, I need more than that. I need more than that because four to five hundred thousand just not showing me everything I want. And this is, this is something that I want, y'all. It looked like I won't because I've seen this house before a couple of times in Vegas. So let's just go ahead and get it started. Now this house right here is 1.1. I kid you not, when I first started looking at it, I swear that it was the same style of the house. It was 700,000 back then. Six to 700. Now they're over a million, okay? It's a nine bedroom, 4.5 bath, 6,000 square feet. It does make you pay some HOA fees, but it's on uh 0.34 acres this house i love how it's like two garages even though y'all know all the time i speak ab about how much i hate the the two garages you know i just keep saying i want a, just a regular two two car garage i don't want a four car or whatever it gives a big backyard it does give a pool but it's also giving nine bedrooms baby every single one of my kids can have a room plus my man can have a man cave plus I can have my office and say, stop playing with me. Ah! Now, one thing I'm a little upset about, y'all know how I love furniture in the house. Y'all know how I love furniture in the house, but this house is coming empty. So we're gonna have to use our imagination, okay? It's giving the double door. It does have glass and y'all know how iffy I am on the glass because to me, it's really hard for uh, me to see, but easy for somebody to see me, you know? So I would definitely put like some like curtains up there for me to be able to peek through like, boop. You know, but um, walking in, you see the little dining room. It does have a light fixture right there. This right here, it looks like the little sitting room, right? So I could definitely make this a little sitting area. Anybody who comes in the house, just come here, sit down, relax, right? It gives another room over here. So I could 100% make this an office or whatever. And I don't know what the door goes to if the, if, well, the garages were in the front of the house, right? So those probably gotta be the garages, which I wouldn't mind, like whatever side I'm keeping, like this would be my side. I would definitely put like a little sliding door there and have like all of my like supplies for the store that I wanna open and stuff one day, all in my garage with my car and stuff like that. Like don't go in my garage, there's no need to. Go in your father's garage on that side of the house. Don't cover my stuff, y'all don't do it. So right here is a nice a dining room. I love the step down. I love the hardwood. So far I've seen hardwood throughout and I absolutely love that. Only thing that I don't have in this house is when you look up, y'all know I really want that big, beautiful chandelier and I don't have that. But look like going over here, that looks like maybe it might be the garage, but we're gonna, I think I'm getting a little too ahead of myself. So we're just gonna go this way. Um, you don't really see the stairs from this direction. So that's the only thing I don't like. Y'all know I really, really want to walk in and have that grand entrance. And I don't feel like I have that here, but it's giving everything else. I'll be like, forget a grand entrance. It's giving me everything else I want. Okay. So this right here is a half bath. It does look a little, hmm, you know, like a little boring. I would definitely come in here and give it color, paint, um, the stuff like carpet and stuff. Bring the color out. Cause it's just giving old and washed out. But I still, y'all, I, I don't think anybody, I don't think I could change my mind about this house. I really love it because it gives me the room, y'all. It gives me room and it's one of the lower prices. I've been looking at $5 million, $10 million houses <laughs> that's not giving me what I want. And for this to give me, boom, a room with a ceiling fan in a nice size closet. And there's supposed to be nine of them. Baby, you can't, you can't turn me away. I don't think, I don't think you could turn me away. I don't. I don't, I don't. So what's this way? This way right here is a bathroom. This is a full bath. 
because I do see a tub in a shower. Okay, okay, okay. I really would rather have like, I could always fix that later, but I really would have like a door entrance or something. I just don't like to have the little curtain anymore. Like, I mean, I have it now, you know, it's nothing bad about it, but I just really want to have like that little open the door type situation. You know, you ain't gotta buy um, that stuff, but it, it, it really don't matter. Cause that, that's like a, if I feel like a type of thing, you know what I'm saying? So you could go up the stairs this way or we're gonna finish going down the rest of the house on this story right here, this first floor. Okay, this look right here is like a little, you could do whatever, okay? I'll probably do like a little coffee section. Some people could do like a little alcohol section. You could do whatever you want right there. Over here, here goes the living room. For me, it will be the second living room because like I said the first, when you first walk in, I'll make that a little living room and then Next one will be my office. I would just have to put some little doors. I love how big it is. You can see the high ceilings and stuff. But for me, I would definitely want to add some uh, light fixtures, some dangly ones. Okay, this right here is where the kitchen table is going to go. It looks like a big kitchen. The colors, it's not too bad. Y'all know me. I just can't stand a color, but I see something I don't care for right now. Um, first of all, one oven what and then i don't like how the pantry is open that's supposed to be the pantry okay i would definitely come in i would come in here and fix some stuff but i still love it and then i don't like how like the refrigerator is over here by itself and then you just have the microwave just sitting there like i would definitely have to fix that up okay but it does have a washer dryer room it's a decent size it's a decent size and usually when there's no furniture there and they just leave that stuff, that's something that comes with the house. Most of the time, that's it comes with the house, y'all. So you ain't gotta buy one. So that's a good thing. It's a good thing, it's a good thing, it's a good thing. I just don't, I definitely want me a double oven. I would definitely have to change that. And I would definitely put a microwave, insert a microwave inside the cabinetry. I don't, I don't like how it's just out. And I did not know we could go this way. Now what's this way? Oh, there's stairs this way, okay. Nope, I don't want to go upstairs yet. Well, at least not that direction. Let's go this direction. We only seen what one room down here so far. Two, two rooms down here. Oh, that like the master. Let's not do that. I don't want to do the master yet. I do what I don't. What should I do? What should I do? Let's go ahead and see this master. Okay, I would definitely have a family photo there or like a wedding photo there. Okay, over here looks like where the bedroom goes. Or actually the bed, where the bed goes. I do kind of like a room that has, that gives me a lot, y'all. Like when you walk in, you don't know which way to go. Oh, there's more over here. Okay, so I would definitely do like the little living room set over there, y'all. Y'all know how I said I wanted to have like a little, nice little living room set or whatever. I would definitely put that over there. This right here is the stairs that we've seen from the kitchen. So I have two ways to go downstairs. Love that. Okay, this looks like my side, okay? Gives you the little part where to make up. And then my side, I do see a beautiful tub. Here goes a toilet. Simple, easy toilet. Not much to brag about, but love the tub. Oh, there's two toilets, his and hers. Never gotta smell me again. I never gotta smell him again like that. Okay, okay. So the, the, the shower is given a decent size. And then over here, what exactly is this? I feel like this could be a closet. Just put up, have somebody come and set it up the way that you want to, or this could be like the shoe closet or something, y'all, even though we don't got shoes like that, so it would definitely be a real closet. I don't, we don't have shoes like that. This right here is a big enough too, but I feel like we could just make it a his and hers type of thing. Like he could have the other one. We could have the same fixtures put up and or he could have those fixtures. I really don't care for those colors. I would get like a white or a gray or something really pretty. Um, and I can have my beautiful, beautiful closet. I like this mat. See, that's what I'm talking about right there. That's what I'm talking about. This one's, I already knew this house is gonna be given. I already knew this house is gonna be given. Like, I already knew it was gonna be given. So I like how you can step outside. I would probably just put like a simple chair or whatever, something easy. Maybe put up a little TV right there on the wall. 
nice and easy and these halls are looking along baby this if this house got space y'all it's got space so here goes another room i'm not seeing a ceiling fan i feel like that's something i would have to add but boom here goes the closet and it's a decent sized room so i love that over here goes two more rooms and then the bathroom so this one does have a ceiling fan i absolutely love that wouldn't do nothing here nice 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 closet wouldn't have to do anything here at all okay let's go check this bathroom out does it have a tub it does have a tub absolutely nice absolutely nice so here goes another room this one has a ceiling fan love this only one don't have a ceiling fan so far okay so there's two Is this six rooms already? Because there was two downstairs, right? The master. This one, this one. And this one. I think that's six already. Now let's go down this way. Here goes, look like another washer dryer area. It's, it's cute. It can work. Okay. Here goes the bedroom. Give me one second, Pop Beats. So here goes a bath, not a bathroom, a bedroom with a ceiling fan. I think this is room number seven. And it's connected to the other room. So I feel like that's eight. Where is the ninth room? I feel like that's eight. I probably gotta go back and count it and y'all figure it out. Y'all figure it out with me. I could have swore that's eight. Unless there was a room, you know how sometimes there's in doors that you cannot walk through, but I'm counting eight, baby, for it to say nine. It says nine. You got to give me nine. It says nine. Unless you're counting my little office space as a freaking room. I want to go in the backyard, of course. It ain't let me. It's not letting me, but I absolutely love every single thing, y'all. I love it all. I just don't like how that one room do not have a ceiling fan. But we could fix that. No problem. And I don't, I don't like the kitchen figuration. I would definitely have to go in and try to figure out, well, not figure out. I would completely change the kitchen figuration. I don't like the kitchen, kitchen figuration at all. Okay. I don't know why I'm going back in here, but I just can't believe that there, there is, unless you know what? They're counting that room connected to the master as a nine. And that would be nine. I didn't think about that till now. Till now. That is the ninth room. But I definitely would not, uh, definitely not have the kids there because it's connected to my room. And no. So, um, I would definitely have that as like an office or man cave or whatever. But here goes the backyard. I didn't think it was going to let me back here, but it absolutely did, y'all. I do like it. It doesn't give me the little sh um, shady area, so I definitely feel like I would have to have that built out or buy one or something like that. Um, but it does give me a pool. It does give a little land. It does not give me enough for animals. Um, but I absolutely love it, okay? that That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. You know what? <laughs> I just realized this house is not giving me the play area, the movie theater space, none of that. And I'm still in love. Like, I think automatically just because this house is giving me room for my kids. A lot of houses don't give me that. A lot of houses is giving me five bedroom with the movie theater and game room. So it's kind of like, oh, we can make it work. I like this, we can make it work. But this house is giving me all the space, just no movie theater, or play area like it's not giving that but then again then again it is giving wait a minute it is giving a second you know it's giving a four car garage two car over here two car over here and i told you we don't even use our garages like that at all and i keep saying we don't really need it um so i could definitely my son is over there making noise like i had to hurry to end this video um i would definitely try to maybe like flip that or fix that or something like put that in there like game everything in there and then be able to walk out the backyard that's absolutely gorgeous i get his house a 10 out of 10 
Okay, 10 out of 10. I know it's missing some stuff, but it's a 10 out of 10 to me. 10 out of 10 to me. Catch you next. We'll see you later. Bye.